Today, Alex and Cynthia commit to each other as partners for life. And they also commit that they will be there for each other through all the triumphs and struggles that life may bring. As they marry today, they've already been there for each other throughout many of the things that they marriage. Stop! For the sake of the nation, the world, the future. You cannot marry this woman. Stop! For the sake of the nation! I covered that. You must marry this woman. You cannot marry this woman. Really? What future war took your soul and or limbs? Damn. Does it hurt? Only when I pee. These two are getting married or I will shoot her! Don't hurt her, Brian. I, I love her. My name's not Brian, it's Alex, Junior. I'm your son. You love Nina? I don't know. I mean, this week was weird and Nina and I were hanging out together and... Oh, Alex. My name's not Nina, it's Virginia. I'm, I will be your grandmother. Nana? Great Nana? How? I got jettisoned into the future by your future, future, future self. Yo. Dad? Why? Freeze! Time Crimes Division. I'm bringing you in. Bring it. Not Nation Time Rangers, 2nd Platoon, 3rd Division. We're here to take your ass back to the past. Shit. My bad. <gasps> Alex, 30697 Alpha 2, we're taking you back for reassimilation into the hive mind. Over my dead hard drive. Ah! Oh, I went. Sorry, dear. Temporal and Environmental Preservationist Society. You're all I'm from the resistance. I'm here to save you. I'm getting too old for this shit. I know the name of a great chronologist. I'll give you his number when we get back to the station. Every time, every time. We just want you to be happy. Then let me buy a car without you guys popping out of nowhere that tell me not to buy it. Then to buy it, then not to buy it, then buy it, but only if they throw in a six speaker system. Let me sign a rental agreement without you guys popping in and bringing in the time cops. Time crimes. Sorry. And for God's sake, would you let me get married? This time is for reals. She gets really pissy when you forget to do the dishes. She's probably the one that would tell us not to get drunk and try to stand in that convertible. It only takes so much. Cynthia, I'm sorry. I know this is all technically my fault, or will be, but I mean, even before all this happened, I was confused, overcome by emotions. Fear, sadness, but counteracted by joy and love, and having that emotional stew inside led to weirdness. But through that and through this, Cynthia, it's made me realize you are my foundation. You are one of, no, the only person I can depend on. You are my rock. I love you. And it was the seeds of that love that gave me the confidence to think 
Maybe the shy guy from the mailroom might have a shot with the hot, smart, and funny lady lawyer from legal. And that love, now blossomed into its true and strongest form, will get us through this and into our golden years no matter what the future holds. Cynthia, will you please come up here and make me the happiest man of all time? Are you fucking serious? You just announced to the world that you love your grandma! And, and that my mom is some sort of tree hugger from the future, and, oh, you're my dad! And I'm keeping the ring. Wait! Mom! Oh, ew, 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 ew. What a bitch. Told you.